Chris, thank you. Hello, I'm Richard Bradley, or Rick Bradley as most folks call me these days, and I'm honored to be president of the board of Mississippi Children's Home Services at this time for several reasons. First, because I believe in the work of Mississippi Children's Home Services and its ability to change the lives of children in this state for the better. Second, because I see us poised to make even greater strides in the future in the care of children and families as we move into our second service, century of service. I see very capable and dedicated staff working hard to deliver services and develop exciting new programs that truly make a difference in the lives of people across the state of Mississippi. We are already a leader in executing the important work of the Mississippi Youth Program Around the Clock. As its name suggests, MIPAC provides services around the clock, 24-7 in the phrase, to children where they live all across the state. For this work, Mississippi Children's Home Services and the state of Mississippi are recognized nationally. This is one category of service in which we in Mississippi lead the nation. Additionally, our new Gulf Coast program will be opening in just a few weeks, and that will allow us to take a huge stride forward in providing services to an area of the state ravaged by natural and man-made disasters. And third, and perhaps more personally, I'm honored to be serving as president at this time because it allows me to honor my mother, Mary Elizabeth Bradley, who served on the board of the Mississippi Children's Home Society, as it was then known, for many years. Her service to MCHS and to the children and families of this state represents the best of Mississippi. Helping one another as and when we are able with our time, our talent, and our money. The reach of this organization spans generations of Mississippians, as well as generations within my own family. The staff and the volunteers, the members of the board of directors, all of us can take pride in knowing that collectively we have touched in a positive way untold thousands of children across the years in this state. Chris, thank you for your leadership that, under which we have grown so much. As I tell people, when I went on the board some 30 years ago, our budget was approximately $240,000. This year it is north of $30 million. And Chris has led us to do that in partnership with, with the state of Mississippi and uh, various department agencies and private donors, all of whom have contributed. It's wonderful to celebrate a centennial. Not many organizations are so fortunate. But our work is not done. It's just gotten started. I invite any and all of you who hear my words to join MCHS in continuing its tradition of service to the children of Mississippi. Thank you.